It was a mid-air scare that had people running from their seats. Passengers on a flight from Toronto to Jamaica say the flight crew did nothing when a woman tried to get into the cockpit. Now, the outburst was all caught on cell phone video. Lucy Lopez reports. Yes, the it's loud, it's dramatic, and it happened two days ago on a flight from Toronto to Jamaica. Sweets Lawrence was on the flight and says passengers had just boarded when the drama began. She jumped up and she started cursing. The situation escalated when the plane was in the air. She came up the aisle with the nail file and she was there to and fro with it. And everybody was getting agitated because we were all nervous. We were all scared. We had persons literally running from their seats. Kids were crying. Big adults were crying. People were horrified. Flight attendants did nothing to stop the woman even after she tried to barge into the cockpit. I became concerned now. So I got up and I said, somebody needs to tie this woman up. And I started asking the flight attendants to get something to tie her up. They said they were afraid. Lawrence says the woman should have never been allowed on the flight because she was acting erratic even before they boarded the plane. She made a big outburst. You know, so when she did that, I thought that, okay, somebody's going to come and hold on to her or something. Nobody did. According to the GTAA, it's the airline's responsibility to ask for security or police help when there's trouble. But on July 30th, Caribbean Air made no such request. And at Pearson today, Caribbean Air passengers were horrified. Oh, my God. When we showed them the video... That's bad. That's wrong. I would be angry if I was on that flight. Well, I would panic, obviously. Oh, my gosh. Would you, no. tell the would you insist that somebody stop her? I will, yes. Because she has to be stopped. Because in you no know, telling what, could a, what else she could do. Now, uh, as you've heard on our show already, it's Jamaican Independence Day, a national holiday there, which could explain why Caribbean Air did not return our call or email. Now, if you're wondering how this woman got a six-inch metal nail file with a pointed tip past airport security, according to CATSA, the Canadian Air Transport Security Authority, uh, nail files are no longer on the list of banned objects. <laughs>